Hi guys, it's Roman the Math Person. Today I'll be going over question 289 on SOA exam P. So pause the video real quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, assume they already attempted it, let's just dive right in. For a certain insurance company, 10% of its policies are type A, that's type A. 50% um, of policies are type B, and 40% is type C. Okay, and the annual number of, so this is our probability, the annual number for an individual of type A, B, and C follows a Poisson distribution with respect to means. So this is expectation. Mean is 1, 2, and 10. Let X represent the annual number of claims randomly selected policy. Calculate the variance of X. Uh, so this is our beloved variance formula, our <laughs> um, second moment minus the expectation, the whole thing squared. Okay, so to find the um, expectation, the E of X, which that's pretty simple. You just have to multiply the expected value times its probability. So that's 1 times 0 0.1 plus 2 times 0 0.5 plus um, 10 times 0 0.4, which is equal to, let me type it in real quick. It's equal to 5.1. Okay. And for e, f, e of x squared, so this we proved in my other video. Let me find it. Knowledge. Is this Poisson? No. Maybe it's, yeah, yeah. Is this Poisson? Yeah. So we proved it in here that the E of x squared, the second moment, is lambda squared plus lambda for Poisson distributions. For, so for using that, we know that this would be equal to, um, so again, E of x squared, I'm going to write it on the top is equal to lambda plus lambda squared. So we're going to take that lambda plus lambda squared, so that's 1 plus 1 squared, times our probability, plus um, 2 plus 2 squared, times 0 0.5, plus 10 plus 10 squared, times 0 0.4. Okay. Oop, that 4 got kind of squished there. 4. Okay, so what would that be equal to? I'm going to simplify first. So that's 2 times 0.1 plus 6, yeah, times 0.5, plus 110, times 0.4. Okay, let me type that into my calculator real quick. I hope you guys are doing this with me as well, so it's helpful for you guys as well. So this is equal to 47.2. So then our variance formula would just be 47.2 minus 5.1, the whole thing squared. Okay. So that would be equal to 21.19, which is our answer, C. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Otherwise, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Bye!